what do you think, what change do you think that you can bring in Africa, specifically Tanzania and the water issue? Well, I think I can uh, make the, the difference of giving them a water supply system, which is a uh, huge difference in their everyday life. The whole world is aware that there is people on this earth who don't have clean water, but it's not something that is so much up in the time, you know. There is always more presenting crises around. I think that if we can give people this basic uh, need that water is all over the world where, where they need it, there is actually uh, 1.8 billion people on planet Earth who, who don't have access to safe water. If we can make this a human right everywhere, it will be a lot easier for people to help themselves. To They have, will have time to take education, mm -hmm. they will have time to develop their society themselves. So uh, I think we, we have to start from the bottom and raise the lower barrier to, to uh, make it a better world for everybody. The, the model functions in this way, that the journey itself that I'm walking all this way, 18,000 kilometers to, to Tanzania from Denmark, is, is uh, capable of providing a lot of media attention. I'm here now, for example, and the, it's the same case in other countries, that I get international media everywhere. The idea is to use this media attention for companies, external companies, to go in and sponsor the water supply system. Uh, because if we get companies to do it like this, they get advertisement in return, and in that way it becomes a good business to go into charity. And that's what I'm trying to create. I don't want something for nothing. I want to make it attractive to companies to spend more of their marketing budget on raising this lower barrier. You know, the thing is that in Denmark, we have plenty. We have enough of Denmark water, we have Denmark enough of, of, Denmark. of everything. <laughs> but still, people are very depressed. People He's are depressed. stressed <laughs> because they work too much, because they need new cars, need mm. new houses, need all kind of stuff that they don't really need. Or they are depressed because they miss a higher purpose with life. Okay. And my experience is that when I uh, do something for others, uh, I feel like I have a purpose with my life. And that is also what I'm trying to inspire others to, to, to find this purpose of life by doing what I'm doing now. It's basically combining my personal passion of adventuring with, with this purpose of, of, uh, of supplying you. people with water. And depress that, that. I'm not depressed. I'm depressed. <laughs> and that is also a part of the, the message to send, you know. Because, as I said, many people in Denmark are searching for this purpose and they try to reach it through money, to work, uh, to get more material stuff and that's not the way to happiness. Mm. So I'm trying to, showing by doing, that it's actually possible to live very, very uh, cheap. I don't spend much money because I don't <laughs> earn any money. <laughs> so, so I live very cheap and still I'm the happiest person I know mm -hmm. because I found a way to combine my personal passion with compassion, a purpose. The website, if you want to read more in English, is www.walkingforwater.dk. Delta Kilo. DK. <laughs> I tried to make some order. That's why.